today we are building at the Demos Staryard. We are going to purchase the Celestial ship. This is a Class B ship and we are going to provide it with a bunch of upgrades and make something truly special. So to start off, we have our 120LD landing bay with a Demos Belly 4 in front. And on top of that, we have our main construction here. So we have the Demos cargo hold 3x3 with a Demos storeroom 1x1 one one at the back. And we have two Hercules DT160 engines either side. For the wings, we've got Demos Wing A port aft with two Wing C's port and then Wing A port. And in front of the cargo hold, we have hull A, hull A, and hull A with a Demos braking engine on the front. Same on the other side, we have our wing A starboard aft, two wing C starboards, and a wing A starboard. Then we have our three hull A's with the braking engine. On top of that, we have our spine A4 with two Deimos radiators, then spine C4. It's the same on the other side as well. Attached to the spine C's, we have Firebolt 4000 suppressors. So we have four of those. And we also have PBO 100 auto neutron tur turrets, which are facing backwards at the back of the wings. And we also have two facing forward at the front of the wings on either side. Under the hulls at the front, we have Deimos Skeg A's just here. And if we select all of this, we'll be able to place this so that the middle compartment of our cargo hold is where it will come up. So if you have the belly lined up with the front, that is exactly where you want it. Next, we're going to put on our landing gear, which is 320CB landing gear. We have four of these, and these just go on the side of our landing bay. So we have it next to our belly, and then just behind there. And the same for the other side. There. And there. Next, we are going to add another Demos storeroom with our DC-303 fast ignition reactor and two 500T helium-3 tanks with two 20T hauler cargo holds. And that's just going to slot on the back of our cargo hold. The grav drive is the RD-3000 beta grav drive which just slots on top of our storeroom at the back. Next, we have our cockpit, which is the DS 20.3 Phobos cockpit with the Deimos all-in-one berth 3x1 behind it. We have the 100 DP slim dock at top and the Vanguard Bullock shield generator. And underneath our cockpit, we have the Atlatl 290B missile launcher. I'm gonna just select all of that and that will sit just on top of our grav drive, our reactor, and the storeroom. Next, we have one of our wings. We have the Deimos braking engine, Deimos hull A, and an engineering bay 3x1 with the spine A4, two Deimos radiators, and spine C4 with Deimos wing A starboard and starboard aft on the side. We're going to select all of that and that is just going to slot in to the side of our ship just slightly off the back. For the other side we have our Deimos braking engine, Deimos hull A, 
and a living quarters 3 by one with the spine a thump four Deimos radiator, another Deimos radiator and a spine C with wing A port and wing A port aft. I'm just gonna drag that over here. Again, push it slightly back. Then finally, we're going to add a third Hercules DT160 engine, which we'll just slot into the back just there. Finally, just to close off the underside, we have two demo skeg Bs that will just slot in behind our skeg A and the, between the skeg A and the landing gear. Same on the other side. I'm up for a little adventure. Time to push some G's. 